All right, welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2. I didn't notice this last time. There's a features here thing that will tell you what your different uh, things do. Not having to have it uh, loaded from the screen. Um, it's the normal stuff basically that we had before that I already explained. Um, it's... Yeah. Uh, I'm on the uh, new... It's basically like this entire thing together. I'm on a um, beta patch now, and I don't like doing beta patches because they're unstable sometimes. Uh, but one of the things that's bothering me is that this screen seems to be messed up. Now, this guy's going to die eventually. He's 83. Um, and when he does, he's stuck on this screen. Um, and I'm, I'm hoping the beta will fix that. Um, and it it doesn't do anything to the succession. He's just stuck there. I, I do have to spend a lot of money on the succession. Uh, but that's not really the point. Uh, the point is that the interface is wacky and it's hard to, d d to hard to judge uh, when things are, are going correctly so I guess I could just ignore it because there's nothing else to do aside from that and this guy's actually the court imam so I could pretty easily get him killed uh, say by um, I don't know let's send him to uh, it's an interesting place for the spread of Islam. Can convert this one. This is the wrong type of Islam. I guess so. I could try to make a uh, body spread here, but that probably wouldn't work. Let's. Well, I mean, this isn't going to work anyway. Put him in Norway. I'll just get him killed quicker. Uh, and if they if they do become a body, that'd be real interesting real fast. <laughs> do I still have the... Uh, no. I had the um, character information on because I was trying to figure out how to fix this problem. But it's a, it's a little uh, thing you can do where you put in the console commands and it shows up stuff. It's got some spoilery stuff that you really shouldn't look at, though. Uh, educating her. So, we're watching the slow destruction of Portugal's stuff here. And in this case, and he's the same guy, so we can't do anything with him. Um... The last thing of the Umayyads over here. Interestingly enough, we probably got this province because we got this thing because of him. Um, and we actually do have a CB on. We don't have a CB on this guy. I should have a CB on him to take this province because I own part of it. I, I guess it's because it's not, like, du jour. I'm gonna go talk to this guy. Can I make you independent? No. So I'm stuck with this title. It doesn't really matter. I mean, having visibility of Baghdad's not necessarily bad. Could come in handy. Alright. Um, we're gonna need a lot of money, and I'm not gonna spend any to uh, get above 3,500 um, stuff. So we shouldn't spend our money on a lot of s things. Yes, that's exactly what I wanted to happen. Good. We'll probably release him, but uh, I'm hoping they kill him and torture him. Uh, this guy is a guy that. Uh, I'd kind of like killed too. Hey, you dudes. I'll send them you to Norway as well. The 
that would be very hilarious if that worked. Uh, you know what? No. I don't really care. I need to keep him. Who else? <laughs> Melzuzi. Send Melzuzi to the Vikings. Uh, I guess we can't send Melzuzi. See somebody else? No. Do have a couple other ones. Uh, I think Zerid is the next most prestigious. So yeah. A little bit less than. Come on, who's got sympathies and everything? Go to the Vikings. It'll be cool. If Svibja becomes. Uh <laughs> uh oh! <laughs> this might backfire hilariously. The only way we can stop the Vikings from raiding us is to spread the word of Allah to them. Which is... is kind of hilarious. Now, I'm above my limits on how many dudes I can have, so my, my, uh, they fixed it, so my stuff is, like, real expensive. Um, I should get a more detailed expenses up here. Oh. Is this my street post? I'm be mad if it is. Nope, Mel Zuzi. Don't care. Building a Mac tab screw here. I can't make anything out of that. I can prison this guy of Tunis. He's still Jewish, see? And then I'm his heir, so they are gonna die out. That's okay. Um, what's he trying to do? Just kill a dude? I'm sorry. Doesn't want to end this part. That's okay. That's okay. The, uh, Jewish characters will never accept conversion, I don't think. No, this guy doesn't have that. It's just the dudes who show up. Talk into the belief. A good plan, even if we don't really like him all that much. I wish ill to him. I think it's because my dudes had uh, casualties, and it's very expensive to uh, maintain these guys. Right. So trying to get our get our dudes killed. You know, in the intrigue thing, there should be a faction. Well it does make sense, they're outside of our kingdom or not. So is this but he's cool. He's in hiding, so he can't be in a faction, I don't think. Gray Eminence. Oh, hey, this is a stupid guy. Nice. You marry this princess of Egypt. My son Masiba lacks all passion. No! No. He might not be king. I don't know if I'm gonna start handing out kingdom titles. I've only got two of them. That was. The Sultan of Egypt, who is a different dude. I'd like to see their little thing break up a little more. 
So the reason I'm not getting a des designated this guy my heir is because um, I can't see what's going on. And the guy who's my heir right now is 83, so he'll die soon. Um, especially being... Are you not in jail anymore? But he'll die eventually. I mean, how how long can an 83-year-old man live? The answer is far too long. These ones are likely to be my trade posts over here. Actually, nothing's built over here. Okay. So, huh? That's actually extremely interesting. I, I kind of want to pull this guy out now. I didn't. I didn't really want that to work. Uh, apparently, I don't have to care about this. It, it doesn't say. It says that I can have decadence, but because I'm not, um, I'm not Ikta, It doesn't seem like it matters to me because it doesn't show up over here. I can't even see. The dynasty without looking at a character who is feudal. So, yeah. Oh, all the way over there. Okay. I thought about uh, taking down the Abbasids and putting my own kingdoms over here. And that might be a long term goal. Um, but for now, we just want to. Right now, we really just want to get this back under control. Um, and then we'll think about doing stuff like that. Yeah, I think I'm going to pull my... Uh, when I can, I'll, I'll pull my um, Imam out of here. I don't want to I don't want to mess up their religious stuff any more than I, I can. You want to be Grand Vizier. He's actually really good at it. This is the derpy guy. He's got a 23 diplomacy. Um, on the other hand, this is one of my emirs. Let's give him a chance. He 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 gets a chance to skill tactician. He's pretty good. He's, he's decent. He could be better, but he definitely could be worse. Courtier and Samarkand. I like her stats. She'd be a good spy master if we could do that. I kinda like genital traits if I can get them. This character is fairly far away. Who Misra? Hmm. I don't have to worry about prestige. It's basically stats that I care about for first one. Okay. Perfect. She might have kids, and that's all well and good. I don't know why uh, your secondary wives don't count as uh, your first wife, at least. I can understand why your secondary wives wouldn't matter for prestige purposes. But your first wife should, otherwise what what's the point of the Misra trait? I'm not gonna spend my piety on this either. If it if I get a revolt because of that, that would be interesting. Uh I need some prisoners. They're obviously not worth anything. What was I looking at? Minor titles. Do state inquisitor. Uh, that doesn't seem appropriate for that. So I don't want to give that to this guy. Although he would stop being such a jerk. I guess that's okay. He's not actually good at anything though. 
That's the interesting thing about, interesting thing about that. I really should pay attention to the modifiers on these things. Uh, because, like, having the Craven trait makes you really bad as a commander, regardless of the things. Um, yeah, so we don't want the uh, Craven guy. This is the other. Like, this guy's probably better even though he's 5 or less. He's also uh, an Amir, so that's a good, good idea. Get your dudes killed. Getting your dudes killed is actually pretty important. Wish I could uh, get horse archers, but I can't. You can't buy them here. The culture is wrong. It could be Byzantine or something like that. I'll take Turkic cultures. Okay, he'll, he'll end his plot now, so I'll have to see that. Oh, I should have imprisoned him. But, uh, hey, I actually want those dynasties to be cool dudes, so we'll, we'll be fine with that. Unmarried heir. Yeah, we don't care about that. That's. Some, not something I really want. I'm betting this is one of my trade posts. Yeah, it was. Damn Vikings. Okay, um, we'll just put them back over here then. I don't want to, you know, actually turn the Vikings into a body unless it can get me some, uh, some functionalness out of it. Which I doubt. I seem scared of that. So, um, I didn't do anything late last week because of this problem, um, and I, I was searching for a way to try to fix it, but it didn't look like I really could, uh, and then I just decided to, you know, mess around with it and see if I could fix it, and it, it turns out it's, it's just an interface bug, so... Miss for now. Is that a new thing? Brother's kid. I can actually teach him if I wanted to. He'll be Jewish. <laughs> that actually can work. If he's not in your court, it can work. Okay, so Abu can be the dude because that one guy had died. Um, let's have you prove the global relations with belief. This is a different guy now. I have 100 relations with him. He must not be the same guy. That's okay. We'll keep him there for now. This is distinguished himself in battle. I'm doubting that's very important. What are you doing, dude? I'm guessing that is what that is. Yes. He's got 2,300 guys. And this guy's got 35, so he should be okay. Stick. Now, what I'm really interested in is if this guy is different. Am 
93 percent is pretty close. If I could kill him, and declare a war on him, that would work out. Or if I could kill him and then have Portugal declare war on him. That would be okay. What? Okay, so that one guy died, but why is this guy my iron name? Okay, but if I put the other guy, if I designate him as my iron. the one I want, right? I think so. It's either that or one of my brothers. I've got brothers who are kind of better, but that's okay. And see, yeah, he's still stuck here. And it doesn't it doesn't change at the end of the month or anything like that. My spy master died. Why? Uh, what? Okay, uh, I can imprison him. Where are you? He is leading troops, it looks like. Leading troops in the south. Okay. Mm, having a crazy spy master? Maybe not a good idea. Uh, he's loyal, 100%, so that's, that's okay. Okay. It's less dangerous to put it elsewhere in the Byzantine Empire, but, uh, you gotta go for the gusto, really. That's the way I say. Tula actually wants to be that. They both do. I think this guy's better because he's not arbitrary. So you win by default. And we'll, we'll collect taxes. Well, this is actually what I'm short on. Imams, you can't do anything about those. You either get a really good one or you don't. Okay. So let's suppress revolts here. Not you. Who did you kill? I'm guessing that guy killed her. Yeah. No. Um. Well. Some cower in fear. Does that remove him from the list? I think it just might have made things worse. So judging from this, I think I probably need... Um, if I had to guess... Let's look at my son here. He's got 181 prestige. And... Republic dudes. Hmm, it's really hard to tell because they probably spent money on it. Age factor. Okay, age factor and prestige. So prestige is. It looks like. Three, about 300 prestige. His age factor is 7,000. Nice. Um, women and children can never be elected. So, like, this guy has, like, 400 prestige. So, it's maybe, like, twice your prestige? 
I don't know. So he's got like, let's say 300. Respect from that. Just, just eyeballing it. That's not even exactly what I was thinking, but, you know, whatever. Let's say 300. And each of these costs what? Does it actually show in the campaign fund? Each of these is 50. 500, 600 for this? I don't know, I'm just gonna start spending money. If I get some tithes, maybe we'll find out. And I might even... Actually, let's let's reduce this. I might even get a better sun. And these guys might end up dying, so... I'm not that old that I can't figure it out before my other sons come back in age. This guy, is he better? Um... 6, 15, 8, 8, 9. This guy is 8, 11, 12, 7, 3. Uh, I think the other guy's more balanced. Even with the 11 and 12, the 3 in learning just doesn't actually matter that much. It's the diplomacy I'm thinking about, though. So maybe he is better. And he's got better traits. And a better wife. Uh, we do have little Octula here, but he's far too far behind to really think about that. Um, I'm used to having a good martial score, but that's not necessarily something that I should lean on as a crutch all the time. Uh, let's switch gears here. Maybe a little bit. Okay, this guy wants to become Grand Vizier. I can pump their stats a little bit. He wants to be Marshal. Okay, we can quickly replace him. Wait, what was it? Masiba. Masiba wants to be Marshal. Marshall's actually not good, but it will get better. Yeah, well. Alright, and then let's replace him again. This, uh, this guy's Sunni. Shouldn't be Sunni. Bro, you're a wizard. I guess I can get another commander. Let's make the Amir of Cordoba a commander, just because. We've got some dudes raised somewhere. I'm not sure what. Oh no, I, I just disbanded them. Get out of here, Vikings! I wish there was a thing like in. Like in, uh. U4, we could just set them to automatically hunt Vikings. <laughs> so here, are 15 or 12. I don't know if there's like a, a penalty to having more dudes than you're supposed to. I could, uh, I could, um, just borrow money to make sure that I get the, the thing. I haven't used this in a while. Uh, and I keep paying them back, hoping that I would have a reason to use them. I keep trying to save them for mercenaries, because it's, it's the best idea. Why? Why don't you like me? What is your deal? You be a state inquisitor. Stop being such a jerk. Who's that anyway? Um, sort of opinion. The other way. So the Emir of Toledo and the Emir of Mercia don't like me. Uh, you don't have the want to be married thing. And you're shit, so you, I can't give you anything. They both want. 
but oh well, he's already a dude. Hmm. I don't know, he's depressed and stressed. Can't assign this guy until August because he's he's bad. What do you want to be assigned? You want to be the Grand Vizier. Pumping his stats, this guy is potentially as good as this guy. I think I like this guy better now. So. Uh, but this guy's ambitious, so he might kill him. I don't. Um, this guy's actually got more prestige. Alright, um, we'll revoke the designated heir. And then we'll just start pumping money into this guy. Should I spend my, my use of the Jewish moneylenders on this? I don't want to go below 50 or so. I don't think so. I don't think that's a that's a good idea. My mom's dead again. My cat is knocking over my trash can. So this guy. I'm going to send you up here again. Get killed. I'm gonna do the same thing. Just everybody who is a patrician, send them to go talk to some Vikings. Swigjod seems oddly, uh, oddly okay with this stuff. It's the same guy. I'm just judging it by his, uh... That's my, that's my trade post. Can't use his boats, his boats suck. It's gonna cost a lot of money to save that one trade post. It would cost less money. To let the trade the trade post fall. 